we can reduce the cost by up to 40 percent today we are producing designer doors for every house it is different from the other one every door is different from the other one and the cost of a designer is the cost of a designer it's very expensive but if we were to standardize we can scale up the juakali that's number one number two we are looking at which are these other products that we can produce i have told you we are targeting leather we are targeting textile because these are labor intensive uh, value chains this will give us the jobs we are looking for let me give you an example today we are importing all the shoes for our children who are going to school what will happen if we decide that in every county we are going to make the shoes for our children we are making 15 million shoes every year for our kids who are going to school that's a huge industry we're going to hire there two three hundred thousand people to make shoes just for our kids going to school and we have said differently we are going to use kenyan leather that is being thrown today that is being eaten by dogs that farmers are complaining they don't know how to dispose it that's how we're going to do it and for your information i have personally visited uh at the river there is a good guy there called rao he is turning our leather into gold you know it, just here in the river so that whole juakali sector is the place we are going to do our leather industry our textile industry yeah. our products of uh, um, construction uh, products industry and most of the time it's just lack of equipment because equipment sometimes is very expensive in fact for example just allow me to say this mm -hmm. i bought uh, this uh, bench in my in my place in current and the fellow who sold me that bench told me he just needed an equipment of seventy thousand shillings to bend to bend the steel you know he was bending it using his own uh, his muscles and it, and it was taking forever so there is just basic equipment given the to land? the dual sector and we can easily double the number of people who today are serving in the dual sector and we have said in our manifesto mm. that we are going to connect every juakali and we are now going to uh, give it a different name not just juakali we're going to connect them to our tibets so that as the graduates come out of our tibets their skills are readily available to scale up our juakali sector yes, so yeah. that's the area where we intend to create jobs and 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 that's a very big space and it will also help us with our program on housing that is supposed to create jobs remember every intervention we are looking at is how do we create jobs because we have five million young people in kenya today with certificates and degrees and diplomas who have no jobs so that is our target